the format of the robot. People still, yet strongly don't want to know or care what a creepypasta is. I actually thought the messages I get are over, but it just returned in the middle of the year with one or more uploads. Since I got away from my actions and mental breakdowns, these people have denied what I said in my confession video, but they always come here to taunt me and overly complain about their quote-unquote childhood crap. And they've gone so far as to report my videos and channel, and send me threats and discriminatory messages if I can't keep this up from all that quote-unquote cartoon creepypasta bullshit. The comments I get from the trolls were not as bad as it should be, but the videos the trolls make are a lot worse than you could think of. They always decide to put my handle onto the titles on their hate videos, but not in the video's descriptions. Trolls always does this all the time, they endlessly make hateful, yet degenerate videos about a channel, and always put a handle in their video titles where the user was mentioned. Oh, for those of you who don't know what a creepypasta is, it's an internet genre of horror stories and urban legends such as Slenderman and Candle Cove, and it's like that of copypastas, but with a horror twist to it. You may have to look up the word creepypasta on Wikipedia for more information. Now back on topic. I always, a couple of times, said that other people's creepypasta stories, including mine, are a work of fiction and satire, and quote-unquote not to be taken seriously. Nope. They flat out called it bullshit, and still always falsely accuse me for owning all of these stories, and worst of all, ruining their fucking childhoods. Sorry I dropped the f-bomb here, but the way they said it to my channel, even goes by those degenerate vion slash go animate grounding and ranting bullshit, makes me cringe terribly to this day. I actually still told them to stay away from creepypastas, including the lost episode genre, and my channel to protect their childhoods, and not to go over and make hate messages and videos, but hell no, they still kept doing this shit just to humiliate me and this channel. That's not really fair. One day, all of this mass drama will eventually be my downfall. They will go so far as to attack my main channel, Topical Studios, for making this channel, despite that Topical Studios seem to rarely upload videos, and still was attacked by edgy kids like the object thingy degenerates. There is some way must be an end to this crisis. If you can't tell that I've gone through with the formidable robot, then these images I saved from my deleted community posts will sum up the problems. Oh by the way, all comments on my videos will be held for review. If there is a comment that contains a story request, I'll just flat out delete it because I don't take requests. Any story request to a THX related, object show related, or outright outdated and terrible creepypastas with the same fate, like those Teletubbies stories for instance, still makes me cringe to this day. If there is a comment that contains messed up hate messages, harassment, death threats, and that god-awful childhood ruining bullshit, I would just delete them as a way to tell them to shut the fuck up and leave me alone already. Sorry that I've lost it for what I said, but still, it messed me up so badly to this day. I'll just have to block and report the users for making these horrible comments. Thanks for listening, and hope that my channel stays cool.